It's good to see you, Bruce Porter. Good to be here. All right, let's take a look at this week's question. Planning retirement income can be tricky. Are there any simple solutions for setting up a secure retirement income strategy? It doesn't have to be terribly complicated, or does it? No, I mean, you can simplify things, um, and that's usually the best option. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the question is, uh, it's very unique when you're designing your retirement strategy for income. Mm -hmm. Well, Social Security is guaranteed once you take it, you get that for life. And if you have access to a pension, that might be another guaranteed source of income. But when you're looking at retirement income strategy, mm -hmm. that's how much can I count on? So now there's three main retirement strategy objectives okay. that I've uncovered over years of doing this. Most people that's, okay, I'm retired, mm -hmm. now I want, it, I want my money out, so what do I want to focus on? Everybody, without exception, says I want, I want my principal protected. Okay. I want to take a little mm -hmm. money out, mm -hmm. and then I want to grow my account a little bit. Sure. Now, that, that's, those objectives are, are good objectives to have. Structuring your portfolio mm -hmm. to achieve that is the difficult part. Okay. Uh, you know, it's all these products and all these different things that we have to look at. So the things that we want to look at uh, today are really, there's only two ways to take money out in a retirement income strategy. And they are? You've got dividends and interest. Mm -hmm or you've got an annuity strategy. Right. That's really okay. the two basic ways that people are gonna access their retirement income. Now, you can apply the objectives to both of those strategies, but there's pros and cons to each one. So let's look at the first one first. Mm -hmm. the, the dividends and interest strategy, there's, there's well, stocks, they yeah. pay dividends. Excess earnings are what dividends are. Exactly, right? and those Bonds can change. And it can change, mm -hmm. it can go up and down. Bonds pay interest, yes. so there's your dividend mm -hmm. income strategy. It's your typical stock bond portfolio. Mm -hmm. The problem with that, it can, on average, the dividend average is around 5%. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can generate some income, but the problem with that strategy is it doesn't hit that main objective, which is I want to protect Protecting my principal. the principal. So, because the market fluctuates all over the place, so you don't Well, know. that's right. We mm -hmm. did a show a few months ago about uh, the, the vol volatility of dividends with a reducing stock portfolio. So, you know, stocks can reduce in value and your dividend can be there. And over a period of time, which we've seen the last few years, your dividends can suffer as a result of mm -hmm. that. Now, if you're relying on that, because you got to remember, like we've discussed, I'm unemployed. I'm retired. Sure. Now I need guaranteed income, right? If, if your portfolio is volatile and it's suffering, that may be something you want to think about when you're developing your retirement mm -hmm. strategy. So the, the negative is nothing is guaranteed with that strategy. Exactly. Now, it's flexible. It's got benefits that way, but it is not guaranteed. And if you reinvest those dividends and the price of that stock goes down... You know, it's like buying everything at a bargain, but right. you know, you know, that's the good part of the stock going down, but you never but know. But again, we're retired, we're unemployed, we want to focus yeah. on having fun, mm -hmm. and we don't want to worry about, number one objective, our principal. Exactly. All right, so now we sh shift over to the annuity strategy. And so in one sentence, an annuity is? It's an insurance contract, and there's various kinds mm -hmm. of annuities. You can get a variable annuity, uh, a fixed annuity, or an indexed annuity. So now... When you're looking at a retirement income strategy, mm -hmm. variables are kind of out the window right. because of the first objective. Mm -hmm. I want to protect my principal. And you really can't get a guaranteed protection with that type of annuity. So really we're going to focus in on a, a fixed a or an fixed. indexed mm -hmm. annuity strategy. So now uh, the, the attributes, the benefits of that is guarantees, guarantees, guarantees. Mm -hmm. The principal is guaranteed, the income is guaranteed, and it's flexible, and the death benefit is guaranteed. Mm -hmm. So when you look at that type of strategy, the guarantee aspects become very valuable mm -hmm. to the contract. Now, the negative aspect of the annuity strategy, it's not as flexible as the dividend and interest strategy. You can't pull your money out and move it over here, move it over there, do this, mm -hmm. do that. But if you don't want to worry about having to do that, Effortless. it's an ideal strategy to look at. Now, there is not a one 
contract, one product fits all. Right. Th that doesn't work. It, there's going to be some people that want a little bit here and a little bit here or all there and all there. You know, if you look at a combination of both of these strategies, you can enhance your guaranteed income portfolio, which is Social Security and a pension. Uh -huh. You can enhance that with an annuity strategy, but and then you can have a kind of a slush fund, 